Watch now. Faith in action. Very good day to all of you. Faith in action is on air, and I'm sure that God has a plan, and that's why you are watching us at this moment. The message today, the short message today, is about the declaration of Jesus when Jesus was in the Garden of Gethsemane. And then he said like this, the spirit is strong, but the flesh is weak. The spirit is strong, but the flesh is weak. And many people don't understand. First of all, they don't understand about spirit and flesh. So let me go straight to the point and change the two words for you to have the right notion of what Jesus was meant to say when he spoke those words. Let's replace the word spirit for mind. And when I speak about mind, it's not the brain. Mind is the place where your thoughts live. Your thoughts are living there in your mind. And also the word flesh, I will replace for the word heart. Not the organ, but where your feelings and emotions live. Okay, then Jesus said, replacing the words, the mind is strong, but the heart is weak. So, if the mind is supposed to be strong and the heart is weak, it is definitely weak. So, God wants to work in partnership with our minds, not our hearts. He asks us to give Him our heart for one particular reason, that he may control it. He will control it, even by force, by power. And he wants to work in partnership with our minds. But, again, if your mind is weak, it's possible. Necessarily, the mind doesn't need to be strong. You may have a weak mind. Why? Because the thoughts that you nourish in your mind are not the thoughts of God. You entertain other thoughts, negative ones, thoughts that bring confusion, thoughts that are coming from the evil one, bringing doubts, insecurity, traumas. Then you become weak. So imagine, the heart is already weak. Now the mind is weak. That's when you become weak. And that's why your life is the way it is. Because you are weak. Although you are weak, I'm talking to you. And I would urge you to come to the UCK Jehovah's Center. You know why? Because God is after the weak. And the UCK also. I want to have the weak in the church, but not for them to keep being weak. I want them to come just as one day, 39 years ago, I came to the church and I was weak, and God made me strong. So I want you to be strong. Listen to me. The UCK Job Center is a church of the strong people. Keep in mind, not the strong in history, not the strong made the difference, but the weak made the difference. Because the weak 
came to the great and powerful God, like Abraham. Abraham was a weak man, but he came to this great, powerful, almighty God, and he became strong. And he changed the history of humanity. I can say the same thing about Isaac, Jacob, Moses. I can say the same thing about Joshua. I can say the same thing about uh, Gideon. I can say the same thing about David. And the list goes on. It's a long list of people who were weak. But even though they were weak, they started to believe they surrendered their lives to the greatest, to the only almighty God of the universe. And that's the link we want to establish in your life. You and this great God. Once you are linked to this great God, the God of the Bible, you become strong. So I invite you to come one of these days, visit us, especially Fridays when we have the deliverance work, and also Sundays in the morning, the main services of the church, 9 o'clock in the morning and 11 o'clock in the morning. Okay? You are invited to come and join us. Now, if what I said is true, the testimony will testify and prove what I'm saying is true. I'll be back right after the testimony. Enjoy the testimony of today's program. Hello, everyone. My name is Elvi Tablo. My life before is a mess. When I, I suffered depression, when I getting married to a man that I thought the man that I'm getting married, he is a good provider for me. I thought he, he, he will take good care of me, he will protect on me, but it wasn't happened. This man that I'm getting married give me a lot of problem because he, does, he do, doesn't want to find ways for a living. So I suffered a lot. I suffered a lot of problems that I never expecting when I'm getting married for him. Now, those tribulations that I suffered before, I overcome when I came here at the UCKJ Health Center. Now I have peace inside of me, I'm happy, and I have a confidence. As my life was transformed, your life will be transformed. So I would like to invite you to the UCKJ Health Center. And I assure you that your life will never be the same. I am sure that you are impressed because what she spoke is very similar to the reality of her life, especially when she was speaking about her past life. And maybe her past life is her present life. And the way her life was changed when she became strong is the way your life can be changed as well. So I invite you to come. We have two churches here in Hong Kong. We have one in Chen Shawan, Chen Shawan, so Kowloon site. We are located at the eighth floor, Trade Square building, 681 Chen Shawan Road. As I said, Chen Shawan, Kowloon site. If you come by MTR, Chen Shawan MTR station, exit B. Two, three minutes walking distance, then you are going to find this great church. Also there in Central, that's our new church, a branch. Then you can go to the 10th floor, 
of Windham Place. So 4044 Windham Street, Central, MTI Station, exit D1, going up to mid-levels. Then right in the middle, you are going to find this building at the 10th floor, the UCK Job Center. So you can come anytime, any day, and God will bless you. Now, I'll not pray. I'll just determine your victory. So if you can, touch my hand. Yes, put your hand connected to mine. Yeah, no need to close your eyes. So are you there touching my hand by faith? Then in Jesus' name, you are healed, you are set free, you are transformed. Amen, amen. This is it. You are blessed. Your faith has blessed you. Okay? Thanks so much for watching us. Tomorrow, we are going to be back with one more Faith in Action program. God bless you abundantly.